हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी विल बी गोइंग टू डिस्कस ब्लॉक नंबर सेवनटीन दैट इज फाइंडिंग डायरेक्शंस एंड वी विल बी गोइंग टू डू लेसन वन दैट इज रिलेटिव मोशन व्हाट इज द नेम ऑफ द एल पी वन रिलेटिव डायरेक्शन सो व्हाट इज आर एम वी विल लर्न अबाउट रिलेटिव एंड कार्डिनल डायरेक्शंस what we will be going to learn in today's lecture relative and cardinal directions keywords we will use are fixed which means something that does not move fixed means something that does not move second cardinal C A R D I C A R D N A L N A L cardinal cardinal directions means these are the four main directions like north east west south next word is relative R E L A T I V E relative means when something is compared to something else now what we will be going to do here <coughs> write down the four main direction north south east and west let's watch this video first there are places left right in front and behind us these are known as relative directions we can move north south east and west these are known as cardinal directions so what are the two sets of instructions for the direction that you are you followed what that video explained you when you move left right up down in the first set of direction and when we move north south east west these are the second set of directions so these are the two kinds of directions how are the directions like left right different from the north and south uh, as i told you in the video when we are moving left right up down the direction change if we change our position so these are known as relative directions if they are not changing they are called cardinal direction suppose this is the person and your right side person is facing the east your left side person is facing the west above direction person is facing the north below direction person is facing the south so hot spot is what will be the direction between south and east we called the direction between south and east is called south east the direction between east and west is called south west the direction between north and south is called north south so we can take the middle direction that is the sub direction the two direction that we are considering like east and west the middle direction is east west understood so that's all about this topic students we will be doing the practice questions of this chapter these are the practice questions let's discuss them filling the blanks with a word from the brackets 
means you have to fill the blank with the given words that is given at the end of the blank a part north south east and west are the directions these are the relative or cardinal directions these are the cardinal directions b left right front and behind these are the relative directions these are the relative direction why relative because they change write any one reason why cardinal direction may be used instead of relative direction so the answer is cardinal direction cannot change but relative direction can change that's why we use cardinal direction as compared to relative directions third question use the direction to show the following questions see there are four directions given north south east west here north is your front direction south is behind uh, east is your right side and west is your left side so see here if you are facing north you are facing north which direction is behind you the direction that is behind you is the south so right answer is south second if you are facing east if you are facing east what is your left so left side is you can also do it north direction which direction is north if you are facing south what is your right side my right side is west d part if you are facing west what is your left suppose i am facing west my left side is south direction so that's all about today's lp read the chapter carefully thank you